Hey, welcome back, everybody. I am so excited. I've been waiting for this update to drop for the last month. The Infected. This is version 14.08 or 028. And I've been playing this game since it first came out. I have close to a thousand hours in this game. This game is awesome. But let's go ahead and jump into it. Uh, the only thing I changed on the settings is I extend the the time on the months so I get a little bit longer um, seasons. It's great for summer, but it's lousy for winter. <laughs> well, anyways, the developers of this game are really awesome. They are always working on this game, and this game is on Steam for 15 bucks. It is well, well worth it. But they've completely revamped this game. The map, I'm pretty sure this map is much, much bigger than it used to be. And we now have an ATV at the beginning of this game. You have to completely rebuild this ATV, and we now have an ATV. Where before, we were on foot. And now we get to search through all this stuff. Where before... We didn't have any of this stuff that we can look through. Oh, can we open that? No. But we have to find everything we need to build this ATV, and then we can take off, and oh, there's the gas can we need. We can take off to our new place that I've already found on the map where I want to go. So as soon as we find everything we need, come on, give me that. We are going to head to our new location. Actually, bark chips we don't really need, but oh, there's more iron there. But I will take them for now. Because if we don't need them, then I'm just going to get rid of them. Oh, there's another tire. Once you get something in your hand that you're carrying, you can't grab anything else. So we'll put this tire on here. We'll put those iron in there and see what else we can scrounge up here. And we can search. Oh, bones! Oh, yes. You might not think bones are exciting, but they are. We could turn those bones into bone shards and make a bone spear. Oh, oh, there's the last two tires we need. And those screws that we just found on the table we need for the Jeep. Or Jeep, the ATV. Yes. So the only thing we need left is one more tire. Oh, yeah, this is great. Now we can pick up all the stone sticks. Let's see what else is out here. Oh, cloth. Oh, we'll take that cloth for sure. Anything else? Oh, yes, we will take this pumpkin. I'm just going to harvest this. Any vegetables I see, I'm going to grab. Now, you could actually pick up melons watermelons, uh, pumpkins, and carry them instead of harvesting them. But I want to harvest them because we're going to get a seed if we harvest them. And we're going to use those seeds to actually grow them. I'm hoping that on this episode we can get that going. Because as you see, we now have a couple seeds. Let's put this bulk stuff in here first. We really don't need the the bark chips, but I'm going to go ahead and hang on to them. And then we still have some first aid stuff here in our lighter. And then in here, we have a little bit of pumpkin, which will bring back some of our stats. There's your stats for protein and all the other good stuff. And then your water. This is your sun resistance you got to keep an eye on. You can actually turn that off. And... These are your task lists. You don't have to really follow that, but I will to a point. Now, if you've watched any of my other seasons, you'll know I am a really bad, crappy driver with this. Um, we didn't have the ATV before. We did have a truck, which I was very crappy with the truck. I was prone to rolling it over. Here, let me show you on the map where I'm going to head. I'm heading right over here. There is a lake here. And there's a mine right here, and that's where I want to head to. 
Oops, did I jump off that? Because um, now all the mines have all the metals in them once you put an extra extractor in there. And that's what I'm planning on doing. Ooh, more bones. We'll take them. And I'm going to try and get everything I can possibly get on the way there. Because, like I said, I want to try and get our base set up today. And if at all possible, run over to the mine and get some iron. So we can make some nails, make some crop plots, and possibly a wagon. A wagon is a plus. Now these are iron fragments. We'll make iron fragments from putting stones in a forge. But, uh, oh, there's iron right there. Iron ore. Oh, and some coal. Oh, that's great. You can put coal in a forge and it burns really long. All right, here we go. Actually, I'm driving this ATV pretty good. All right, uh, this way. Am I going the right way? Nope. I'm not going the right way. And yes, that is a froggy. Oh, sparks. I hope, I hope you can't damage this thing. This is the way I want to go. And now, from my last series, I did not readjust the foliage. I, at the very end of my last series, I had the foliage down. Okay, we are going the right way. And I forgot to readjust it on this one. Plus, I think I have the animal spawns up pretty high. Because I was trying to give myself a challenge. So I'm going to have to readjust that. And I think I upped the vamps, so I'm going to have to adjust that too. Because I had the vamps up pretty high. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is just out and out gorgeous. Oh, we got water here. Is this it? Oh, no, we got a ways to go. Boy, the developers outdid herself. This is a thousand times better. Oh, which way? Which way? We are going to the left. I was hoping to find a dead bird on the road. Dead birds you can harvest and you get a lot of feathers. Originally you used to get meat from the birds. Uh -oh. Fork in the road to the left. Oh, 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 we'll take that. I see two of them. This is your watermelons. And I just seen this. We got some cucumber. All right. Burning up all of our fuel, getting on and off. That mine has got to be around here somewhere. Oh. oh, straight ahead is the mine. Should build right next to the mine, but I need the water. Is that the mine? No, the mine is a little bit forward. Sorry, I'm not going to worry about the mine. We need to get to our base. We're up in the mountain area. This is so gorgeous. I can't believe it. He has really done such an awesome job. They have a very small development team. Okay, the mine has got to be right here. The mine is over there somewhere. Because where our base is going to be, let me see if I can zoom in. The lake is right here. So we're going to be right near that. 
Hopefully we can get a big enough flat area. All right, there's the lake. Well, this don't look too bad. Actually, it looks pretty nice. Put our base right in here. Got plenty of water. A lot of rocks. Now, from my understanding too, for fishing, it used to be you'd just take a spear and you go through the water. But this water looks really shallow. Oh, you can't go under. Not really. We're not really... Go oh, there we go. I don't even see any fish. Yeah, I don't see any fish. Where did I park my ATV? I don't see it. Hang on. Let's zoom in. Oh, as far as I can zoom in. ATV's over there. <laughs> but, oh, this is where we're going to make our base. All right, my ATV right there. All right, first things first, what we do need to do is make an axe. We're going to need some stick, though. Because I have this new crafting system, you can go in here, and if we want to make an axe, you just click on that. Um, uh, you're missing things. Yes, of course I am. Oh. Oh. Let's get out of this. Need to find some stick. Sticks, some stones. Wow, I don't even see anything. Oh, there's a stick. I don't even see any stones around here. Wow, I should have picked all that up over there. Up oh, there's stone. I just lose my ATV now. Probably. That's all right. Go back in here. Click on here. And click this. And boom. And if you're unsure, you just go back to here. Click this. Oh, you're going to be... Come on. I got my shard. Stone axe just needs one stick. Oh, and one stone. I made myself a shard. Didn't I? Sure did. I did that wrong. You know, see, that's what happens. Now i got to find another stone. Been a while since I played. Well, well, we'll take that. Okay. Now i got my new stone, so we will... Oh, man, you can't see over here. Let me into the shade where you can see. Then you just click on Axe. Puts everything in there. Click Craft. And then if you go into your backpack, you put it on number one. Pretty cool. And if you click number one, put your axe out. Now there is a some kind of glitch. And I don't know how to use the glitch, so... Um, let's see. I want to find where our base is. We're going to clear that area out. Okay. Not worried about picking those up. Oh, hey, I'll take that. 
Thank you very much. Oops. Oh, I don't want to destroy that. Are we full? Yes, we are. We'll go ahead and eat that. Eat that. And we can pick that up. How did they do that? All right, what is our task? No place like home. Okay. I don't know how they did that. I'll have to figure out how to do that, where they just click crazily, and they just make tons of these. All right. But one thing I like to do is I will set up, let's see, inventory, build, uh, no, placeables, saw bench. I will make three saw benches. Now, oh, yeah, I forgot about that. No, you can't make that yet. You have to make this. Land claim. Land claim has to go in first. We will put that right there. And this, let's see, this is Gmo's land. Gmo's land. Okay. All right, how do you get out of that? Now, reason for that is this. Is it this? Now, this will give you your, it's a light value and your noise value. And it'll also give you this. That's the radius in which we can build. Now your light value and noise value stays up on the top. And you can leave that on if you want to. This will tell you exactly what your build radius is, this red mark circle. If it doesn't bother you. I uh, don't really need to leave that on. And uh, now that we have the land claim down, we can start building. Uh, no, 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 no. Other, no, not other. Placeables. Now we can get our workbenches, or, or saw benches, ghosted in. And I always make three of these for a reason. Because with three, you can carry three logs. So, as you're carrying three logs, as you can see, I chop, I chop a whole bunch down at once. And this way, I just have to go grab a bunch of these at one time and bring them back and forth. Because you you're going to need tons of planks for building. So, as you're bringing them back and forth... You can just plop down one, two, and three. There you go. And I'm going to probably take every log out of here. Now, another thing we're going to need, which I know oh, I don't have any sticks. Looks like we're getting a lot of stones around here. So let's grab these stones and we got another stick. And another stick. These things really highlight at night. We are going to need a pickaxe. So let's go back in here to our little... Oh, I hate this thing here. Let's get back into the shade where we can see it better. We're going to need a pickaxe. And let's see, pickaxe picks it. Not this one. I'd love to have this one right now. Uh, stone hammer, upgrade tool, pickaxe. Pickaxe, we need one stick. Okay, that's everything we need right there. So we craft that. That is done. And now that is on number two. All right.
And another thing we're going to need, we are going to need these. We don't have what we need for that. Because we need sticks, plant fiber, and blades. So we did pick those up. So we'll make the blade. Then we'll make these. So what are we shy? Uh, oops, no. Check my inventory. Inventory. Not enough sticks. Guess so. Oh, I know one thing I do want to make. Right off the bat. Mm, 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 placeables. Storage. We're going to need a few of these. Thought I seen something. And these just take eight planks. And we can't take any planks out of there. Where's my buggy? Let's throw some of this in there. Just to get out of our inventory. Oh, no, give me that back. And you can hold... No, give me those stones, too. You can hold charcoal, oil. Smoke. Come on. There you go. Okay. Uh, let's see, now we can grab some of these planks. For when we start picking up little eyeball stuff. And where do we want to build our house? Uh, foundations. Might as well get that started. Put that right here. One there, one there, one there, one there. We'll just start off small. Give me my pickaxe out. Get rid of this stone. And we'll take all these. Come on, get out of there. Oh, whoops, now we're heavy. Yeah, you got to watch your weight. That's why I like to leave that thing on the side there. Because right now our weight is a big factor. And we don't want to waste these stones because they will come in handy later on. They will definitely be coming in handy. Oh, that is full. Okay. Let's go back to get a few trees down. Because we're going to need to clear this whole area. Now, I'm not sure how long before... Any kind of vambies, bugs, or whatever comes to attack us. Oh, yeah. The other thing we're going to need ASAP is we need a campfire. Placeable. Oh, no, food. We're going to need a campfire here. And then over to campfire... Other, nope, placeable. Oh, come on. Where is it? Is it under food? No, it was under construction, wasn't it? Yeah, right here. And you need to put one of these down over the top of it. In case it rains. Okay. Actually, all those stones I just picked up will be for that. I'll throw these on here. And throw these down. 
Need to make some firewood. Firewood's easy to make. We need that firewood for the campfire. Uh, how many does that take? Eight. Okay. That's what I thought it took. And those sticks aren't going to go to waste because we're going to need them too. And we need more stones, which we have the stones. And we're losing our light. All right, because this is got 60 water in it, which we're going to drink that. And now it's got no water. So we just go up to the water. And come on, click on the water. Went not deep enough. There it is. Fill that up. Now that is dirty water. Went a long way for that. And we can put that in there. Now this will take 200. And we only need, or we can only use 60 at a time. Now once we get to a, come on. Once we get to an aluminum canteen, that takes 200. Now I'll only put a lot of people will fill that thing all the way up, but since we can only do 60 at a time, I only fill it to 180. I mean, everybody's different. Everybody has their own gameplay. Because I can only fill it three times. I only fill it three times. Okay, now I'll take these. I'll pick all these up. And I'll put these in here. as firewood. The reason I built the shelter first is now we can light that up. Now we really have no real food on us as of yet. Uh, we'll take these few planks here. Need to make a bed soon. Uh, grab the rest of these logs, and I need to make a spear because we got a few frogs laying around here. What? Oh, melon! Harvest that. We got plenty of those. Uh, let me go ahead and eat one of them. Uh. So, I mean, we're doing good on water. That we can pick up whole. All right, let's go back to try and get this shelter up and running so we can get a bed made. A lot of grinding in this game when we first start off. We've got a lot of stones here. I need to get a spear made. That frog will give us meat, which is protein. But right now we're doing good on everything, so I'm not worried. Plus, we got five of those meat packs. A lot of people don't use those. I will use them in case of emergency. It's about the only thing that's going to give you health back at the beginning. And right now we have 100% health, which is good. But every time you die, you lose health. And hopefully we won't die. Okay, let's get these planks going. We're going to need planks. Okay, we'll start throwing these in there. All those are going... Got lots to do, little time. Okay, 
you're done. You're done. I don't even know if I'm going to put a roof overhead right now. I'm going to get a bed made real quick. Okay, and you got lots of logs down on the ground we need to get up. And I know off camera I am going to log as much as I can because I know it's going to get a little bit boring. Oh, I'm running out of stamp. Watching somebody do logs all day long. Okay, we're done with logs. And I don't know if they'll despawn. I think if I'm on, they'll, they won't despawn. But I know when I log off, they will despawn. Oh, ain't got no room. Okay, let's get a bed made real quick. Oh yeah, I got no room in me. Uh, placeables, furniture, bed. Because once you get tired, you cannot do much. And it doesn't matter. Anything you put down, you can move. So it doesn't really matter where you put things. All right, these are just planks. We have plenty of planks. So let me go ahead and empty this stuff out. We're getting a lot of stuff in us. Until we can start getting a little bit more weight and a bigger backpack. And that won't be for a while. And I think I did spot where the swamp is. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, man. That's not what I wanted. Well, we got a little sleep in us. Not quite what I was hoping for. But, hey. It is what it is, right? Okay. Let's go ahead and make a door. Like I said, everything is movable. So even though, whoops, walls. Even though this is just a little itty bitty, what I like to call crap shack, we can move everything here. And I'm just going to build solid walls for right now. Because, like I said, everything we can move. Because this is going to be a lot bigger. Oh, I guess that's too close. There it goes. Everything is going to be able to be moved. Because I will end up having windows and all that good stuff. I need to make myself a spear. I'm not worried too much about putting a door on that yet. Oh, ran out of planks. Did I run out of planks here? Nope. Yeah, a few more planks here. Okay. But we got our little crap shack here. I'm going to go ahead and call it here because what I'm planning on doing is as soon as morning comes up, I'm going to go ahead and deforest all this, start getting some log carts set up so, and start filling them up, clear all these stones out, and get us a little bit better start for the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this. We are set up in our new location. This is where it's going to be, and I hope you guys stick around for the next one. This is Gmo signing out for now. Till next time. All right, everybody. Bye-bye for now.